hey, you've got a fire in the house, where do you meet? Mm -hmm. uh, for the Fulton family, it was always the, the mailbox across the street. We knew that. Uh, my parents drilled it into my head. Uh, the same with, with severe weather preparedness. We knew to go to the basement. We knew that if the weather was bad enough, uh, we might even get a soda. We didn't have a lot of soda in the Fulton house growing up. So, you know, those kind of things. Uh, you have those conversations now. You just pause the TV and say, hey, do you know where you can go? These are the times to have the conversations now instead of during an event. We have calm weather through this morning. Sunshine actually early today and then some more clouds build in later on. Shower chances will also arrive with those clouds later tonight. After the rain passes, we are tracking a cooler trend here pretty soon. Not for this afternoon, not really for Friday, but this weekend, next week, fall kind of kicks into gear. Temperatures this morning in the middle 50s, a calm breeze, dew points also in the mid 50s. So we do have some patchy fog, but overall visibility in a good spot. We'll look at your visibility in just about 10 minutes. Actually, we'll do another check on that. Our cloud conditions right now quiet through southern Wisconsin, but this is the line that we're tracking this big system off to the west. Stumped a lot of rain through the Dakotas and Montana over the last 24 hours. We're tracking this line of showers that's going to push in later today, bringing some showers and storms to our westernmost counties first and then more widespread rainfall overnight. So by noon, we're overcast for Grant County. Still seeing sunshine, though, east of Madison. Spotty showers possible right around the evening commute. The heavier rainfall comes in overnight. We are going to have a few rumbles of thunder with this line as it passes through. Showers might linger southeast of Madison until daybreak, but most of this clears out pretty quickly. So we're back to a sunny sky by Friday afternoon. Notice that shift in wind direction later on in the day west in the more of a northwest flow for the weekend. This slight risk has expanded a little bit more to include parts of Richland County, parts of Grant County. That's where those storms could build in closer to 7, 8 o'clock when we're still warm. The rest of that line fizzling as it moves east and also moving into a more stable environment. Rainfall totals staying highest off to the west, generally close to a quarter of an inch. Some areas where we do see those storms could get closer to a half of an inch of rain. Sunny this morning, clouds later on, rain expected overnight. Highs today will land in the middle 80s. We stay in the middle 80s Friday, Saturday. Saturday comes along with a lot of sunshine and then the cooler temperatures really kick in. Highs next week in the middle to lower 70s. Our overnight lows trending a bit above average will stay in the mid to upper 50s.